All right, first and foremost, so let us give her praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahushai, Bahashim Akakodash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders who rule well at Great Millstone. A peace and salutation to the Akims out there pushing this gospel in sincerity and truth. I'd like to say shalom to all the humble and sincere sisters out there as well. Right, coming out with this lesson today, based on the matter of um, staying away. From these two thirds, you know, not having any relationship or friendship any of any sort with these wicked Israelites, right? Because all they will try to do is lead you astray and turn you away from Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, right? And let me just get into the scriptures through the power of the Mosai. Right? It's the Second Corinthians chapter six, verse fourteen. <clears throat> it's a B not equal unequally yoked together with unbelievers for what fellowship hath righteousness with unrighteousness and what communion hath light with darkness right these these wicked these unbelievers these these wicked israelites they are contrary to all the laws statutes and commandments of the mosai right they are they 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 contradict all the mosai's words Right, and they are not aligned in the Mosai's ways, right? So we are not we are not supposed to have any fellowship with them, as it say. For what fellowship are the righteousness with unrighteousness, right? They are unrighteous. They are evil, wicked, right? This is First John, chapter two, verse fifteen. Say, love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. Right? We are not to love this world. We are to, we are to condemn this world and condemn the wickedness and the scum that is in this world. Right? All the devices, or all the philosophies and the religions, right? all the beliefs, we are to condemn that. Right? This is a wicked world, right? It is given into the hands of the wicked, right? These heathens, these wicked Israelites, you understand? They, they, they follow after Esau, they worship Esau, right? They worship money, they worship fashion, they worship bling, right? They don't care about the Mosai, they don't care about Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, they don't care about the laws. Right? They don't care about living a righteous life. They want to be wicked. They want to be evil. Right? They want to follow after Esau. They want to be homosexuals, lesbians, transgenders, atheists, right? Feminists. All those labels, they want to be that. Right? That's why they're gonna get put to death in this place. This is Psalms chapter 1, verse 1. It says, Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Most High, and his law doth he meditate day and night. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. His leaf also shall not wither. And whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. Verse 4. Say the ungodly are not so, but are like the chaff which the wind driveth away. Therefore the ungodly shall not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Most High knoweth the way of the righteous, but the way of the ungodly shall perish. Right? So if uh, do, we not, we not supposed to be among these wicked people, right? The most I know the way of the righteous, the ungodly shall perish. These wicked niggers will perish. Right? They will perish with Esau. Right? Edom, they will perish. Right? Romans chapter 12 verse 2. Say, and be not conformed to this world, 
but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of the Most High. Right? That what we had to do. Right? That is, that is what we had to be thinking more. That what we had to be meditating in. That is, that is our that we goals. That we aspirations. Right? The will of the Most High. And what is the will of the Most High? To worship Him and keep His laws. And that what we ought to be doing every second of our lives. Right? Praying and fasting and teaching and learning. Right? And, and just resonating in this truth. Right? Not being out like these wicked niggas. Right? In the parties and, and the raves. Right? And all the other stupidity. Right? We are not to be like these wicked Israelites. We are not to be like the man worshipping the white man. Right? Because what they just do is worship Esau. They worship Esau. Watch, watch, watch your woman straight in the air. Contacts. Right? One of my friends um, used to wear contacts. Blue, blue, um, blue, gray. All these, all these things. Because to them, that is beauty. Esau is beauty to them. Right? Bleaching the skin. All these things. Right? To look like Esau. You understand? Men, men cutting off the private part. And, and putting on a vagina. Right? So you don't have a vagina. Vice versa. Right? This is, unac this is unacceptable. These people have to be put to death. Right? For the wickedness. And we're going to book of Proverbs. Chapter 13. Verse 20. Say, He that walketh with wise men shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Right? The scriptures say in it here. Easy. Verse 21. Evil pursueth sinners, but to the righteous good shall be repaid. Right? We are not to, we are not to walk with fools. Right? We should work with wise men, you understand? Fellowship with brothers and sincere sisters, right? That is what we're supposed to be dealing with, right? That is what we be friendship. That is what we're supposed to be, right? Together, brothers and sisters, right? Sons and daughters, right? Not with these niggas, you understand? Not with, not with these, 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 these heathens. Right, lost and confounded. Right, we go on to the Apocrypha. This is Ecclesiasticus chapter 37, verse 12. Say, but be right, Ecclesiasticus chapter 37, verse 12. We say, but be continually a godly man, whom thou knowest to keep the commandments of the Most High, whose mind is according to thy mind. And will sorrow with thee if thou shalt miscarry. Right? Yeah, that the mine is according to thy mind. Right? The brothers of GMS, we are on one accord. We are one mind. Right? We are one body. Right? One movement. Right? Not, not these other niggas. Right? They, they hate each other. They kill each other and rob each other. And have sex with each other. Wives. Right? They don't love one another. They have no love within them. They have darkness within them. Wicked and evil. Right? They love money. Right? They love they love fashion. They love fancy car. But they don't love one another. Right? Wives don't love their husbands. Fathers don't love their sons. Mothers don't love their daughters. Right? Wicked, evil, pure evil. Right? Be but be continually with a godly man whom thou knowest to keep the commandments of the most high. Right? That's who we had to that's who you had to lime around. That's who you had to be around. That we had to talk to. That we had with godly men, right? To keep the commandments. Right? 
God. As they say, you are who you, you are who your friends are. Right? And as the scripture said previously, if if you you mustn't yeah line with fools, right? You mustn't guard yourself around fools, right? Then you'll be a fool. But if you guard yourself, if you be continual with a godly man, men, brothers, your brothers, right? They educate in here. You say iron sharp with iron, right? Being around your brothers, right? You grow, right? You teach them, they teach you, and you all grow, right? And become more intelligent every day, right? By teaching each other, by learning, by watching each other videos, by having conversations with one another, right? This is the way it's supposed to be, right? In the last scripture in Matthew chapter 10. The 16, right? The most I teach you how to deal out here. I say, Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Right? We are to be wise as serpents. Right? Harmless as doves. Right? We are to know how to think out here. Right? Only speak to we only speak when necessary then. Right? Don't have any kind of Relationship with these wicked niggas, you understand? Talk when necessary, move, right? Move like a serpent, right? That's how we had to move out here. Just say the most high, right? And with that, all business was that defined. Give all praises, honor, and glory. See, Yahweh, Bahashim Yahushai, Bahashim Kakadash, Shalom Israel.